Hello, Assalamu alaikum. Welcome back to my channel one time again. If you don't know me, my name is Dajaf and welcome to my channel. If you are new here, so please subscribe to this channel and turn on that notification bell as well. So you can get notified whenever I upload a brand new video. So finally, we are back with another view and today we are going to talk about another sunscreen, uh, unfortunately. <laughs> And the sunscreen we're going to talk about today is this one. This is the Clean Beauty Baloka Glass Skin. So, we will talk sunscreen ke mein baat and we will see whether it's worth the hype, whether it's worth the price, whether it is good or not. We will talk about all the ingredients in detail. And at the end, I will tell my final verdict whether I will recommend this sunscreen or not. So, stay tuned till the end and watch the video till the end. Okay? So, let's start our review. So this product retails for 2000 rupees. In 2000, you're getting 50 ml of the product. Okay, first of all, I will show you the packing of this one. This is how the packing look like. It got that like animated sort of a box. The brand claims it is cruelty free, vegan, and paraben free. And if we see the inside packing, inside you got this like a tube of 50 ml, very slim tube with the same, uh, you know packing like the animated sort of a packing which was on the box and the, at the back you get the whole ingredient list which i do like yeah, there you get also get an expiration date and this is how the packing look like the packing is actually in my opinion is kind kind of cute okay it was about to fall so the packing is actually not bad at all but 2050 ml uh, it's a bit expensive in my opinion like um for me 50 ml of the sunscreen i will go uh, for the 50 ml size very quickly okay so but let's see if it's actually a very 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 high class formula or not obviously it's a sunscreen so first we will talk about their sun filters so it's basically a hybrid sunscreen meaning it has both mineral and chemical filters in it then for the mineral filters it has zinc oxide and titanium dioxide in it and for the chemical filters it has homosalate it has octyl methoxycinamate it has octyl salicylate and it also has benzophenone 4 and it also has octorelin. So first of all, we know about zinc oxide and titanium dioxide. They are the most commonly used and most popular physical sunscreen filters and one of the most safest sun filters you can ever found in this whole market very good does not need an introduction they save you from both uva and uvb rays okay and they are considered 100 percent safe and if we talk about their chemical filter so first of all it's the uh, chemical filter user which is octyl methoxycinamate it will protect you from uvb rays it's a chemical filter it's an oil soluble chemical filter and it will protect you from uvb rays it does not have a very uh, good sort of a history in term of that this ingredient do uh, get absorbed from your skin but the proper studies have not showed uh, whether it's harmful or not so we are still you know at the uh, middle okay so next filter just me use which is homosalate so homosalate is also going to protect you from uvb rays homosalate is also an oil soluble ingredient Homoslate is kind of like meh in terms of like sun protection. It does not uh, pr provide you that, that much of a sun protection in my opinion. And it's also not that strong of a sun filter on its own. And then the Agla filter which is octyl salicylate. It is also not a very strong chemical filter. It's uh, the octyl salicylate is like kind of a, like a yellowish oil type of a sun uh, filter uh, ingredient. And this will also protect you from UVB rays. Usually this ingredient is used to like solubilize some other very solid UV filters. And this is the next chemical filter user which is Octorelin, also an oil soluble chemical filter. It is uh, used uh, to make the formula more water resistant. And this does not have that of a bad of a uh, history on its own. It's kind of a fine filter, but it's also not that strong of, of a filter on its own. And then we have benzophenine 4. It's not benzophenine 3, it's benzophenine 4. There's a difference between both of them. This ingredient uh, improves photostability of the formula and it also uh, uh, like uh, improve the for, uh, like the shelf life of the ingredients, of the other ingredients to perform much better at the longer time. So it also helps in that as well. 
सो दिस कम्प्लीट्स आवर सन फिल्टर्स सो ओवरऑल इनका जो मेन मोटिव है विच आई सी लाइक दे हैव मैंशन इन ऑन द इनग्रीडियंट्स द मिनरल फिल्टर्स आर देर मेन फोकस ऑन द फॉर्मूला देर मैंशन एट द टॉप ऑफ द इनग्रीडियंट्स so it means they want to tell you that the mineral filters are being used in this formula at high percentage um, not the chemical filters and if you look at the chemical filters there is a ingredient list and then you will see like at the very end or quarter end you will see the those all of those uh, these uh, chemical filters and uh, according to what i am understanding the brand motive was to make also like a mineral sunscreen but they have added these chemical uh, filters to make uh, the mineral sunscreen experience much more better to make that more photo stability uh, more water resistance and to solubilize some you know all of these uh, uv filters so that's what i'm trying to understand we will get into that whole texture and everything later on but if miski baki ki ingredients ke bare mein baat kar dete hain isme alpha arbutane mil jata hai alpha arbutane is good for brightening purposes it's a good ingredient they have also mentioned like at the packing powered with alpha abutane it like they mention on the box so alpha abutane ki ki percentage achhi hai then you also get sodium ascorbyl phosphate it's a stable form of vitamin c good ingredient then it has aloe vera extract aloe vera extract uh, is good for hydration then it also have disodium edta e, this is kind of like a shelf like a shelf life ingredient as well this improves uh, the other ingredients uh, to perform better by time by time like the time by time goes for the formula this ingredients will help to remain other good ingredients to remain active effective okay next this sunscreen also have glycerin in it does not need any sort of introduction then this ingredient also have citrate 20 this is a kind of a ingredient which helps to mix oil and water love ingredients together and it also uh, used in uh, i have also seen this in really uses a lot of like face washes as well as a surfactant as well but this ingredients can some way irritate for irritate sensitive skin but when the formula is too much hydrated like with other many good hydrating ingredients so this issue is being a little bit you know minimized then mashallah say we have that another ingredient again which is act- acrylate c 10 30 alkyl acrylate cross polymer yes this is the whole, whole freaking name of this ingredient so what this ingredient do this ingredient helps to thicken up the formula as well and it also helps to spread formula well as well okay then this sunscreen also have cyclopentasiloxane it's a silicon to give you that silky finish in the formula next then is in sunscreen mean you in green use jo have that is cetyl alcohol cetyl alcohol is an emollient which helps to give you that smooth nice feel to the skin then in sunscreen mein aap logo ko weed gum oil bhi mil jata hai which is like an um, it contains natural vitamin e as well and it's been to preservative use hai usme aap logo ko bht mil jata hai triethylamine mil jata hai and phenoxythenol mil jata hai and at the last it's been mentioned that it has been used iron oxides for the formula to give you the a bit of a tinted finish us tint ke bare mein bhi hum jayenge in a second ke what that tint is and everything theek hai but isme iron oxides bhi mentioned hai but isme nahi mention how many iron oxides and kon kon se so that's a bit of a confusion as well but anyhow now we have talk about the ingredients so now let's get into the formula of this sunscreen i will show you the everything so the brand claims it will leave no white cast it will brighten up your skin tone and fades dark spot ओके सो जब मैंने फर्स्ट देखा सो आई एक्चुअली थॉट इट्स अ टेंटेड सनस्क्रीन ठीक है आई एक्चुअली थॉट ओके इट हैज आयरन ऑक्साइड इट विल बी अ टेंटेड फॉर्मूला बट अगेन इट दे हैव आल्सो दैट कॉन्सेप्ट दैट द आयरन ऑक्साइड्स आर बीइंग यूज्ड टू मिनिमाइज द वाइट कैस बट इट्स नॉट इट्स नॉट गोइंग टू गिव यू दैट बीबी क्रीम वाली फिनिश ठीक है सो दिस इज द फॉर्मूला so this smells really beautiful in your skin as the name is of the sunscreen that it is a melt in glass skin we will get into the glass skin level into a bit as well but this is how the sunscreen is being blended now looking at the finish of the sunscreen it is very beautiful but i don't know if it's if the brand has used um, you know the pure titanium dioxide and zinc oxide or the nano titanium dioxide or zinc oxide because i see the white cast is a bit less 
for the pure mineral zinc oxide and titanium dioxide and the brand has not mentioned whether they are nano or the pure one uh, it's not written the nano one so it can be the pure one but i would love if the brand will confirm me so we can have a short tk whether they are you know um pure one or the nano one but the white cast is a bit less so i am assuming by my own self if they are the nano uh, zinc oxide and titanium dioxide okay next up agar hum iski means ki scent ki baat karu it has a floral sort of a scent but is it has a sunscreen wali scent it has a sunscreen pure jaise ek sunscreen hoti hai wo wali fragrance hai but it's not bad like some sunscreens ki hoti na medical wali fragrances the fragrance free sunscreens it does not have that sort of a fragrance i don't know why i feel that there is a bit of a fragrance used but iski formula pe nahi likhi hui so let's just assume ki it's a fragrance free formula but i feel a bit of fragrance is used but ye bilkul bahut light si hai it's not like anything to worry about ki bahut strong fragrance hai and talking about the glass skin wala claim um it gives you a nice um like i can say demi matte sort of a finish it's not matte it's not completely like a glass skin it's like in between because obviously isme mineral jo filter use hue hain unka main highlight bhi hai so the mineral filters hai wo aapko aise glass skin wali finish nahi dete they give you the more of like a mattifying finish because unki jo original form hoti they like chalk powders theek hai so that's why they give you a bit of a mattifying finish i like the finish of this formula I really like it. It does not feel drying. It does not feel um, overly, overly hydrating for my oily skin. I like some sunscreens to be, you know, stick into my skin. That does not move. So it does not move and give you a beautiful finish as well. So I do like the finish of the sunscreen. Overall, the sunscreen. Ki baat karo. I did enjoy the sunscreen. Do not be confused. Ki you can use this as a BB cream. It's not like that. It's a clear sunscreen. It iron oxide are just being used to minimize the. wide cast of the mineral filters there is nothing like a bb cream type of a finish in it and neither the brand is claiming ki isko aap as a bb use kar sakte ho because there are some other you know brands who claims ki you can use this as a bb cream and when you will get the product you will be like where is the foundation wali finish thik so yes i do think sunscreen is good um if you enjoy a hybrid sunscreen formula because they also main motive is like the mineral filters which i do like is my mineral filters ki percentage zyada use hui hai which i do appreciate in a, if i am using a hybrid sunscreen at least usme mineral filters ki percentage to zyada honi honi chahiye also it has like alpha butane so it has sodium ascorbyl phosphate so you get a bit of vitamin c you get a bit of alpha butane so you get a bit of you know um mujhe jaise ne claim kiya dark spots fade karne wala a bit of a brightening effect to your skin as well thing but i still think 2000 is a bit pricey i think it should be uh, priced uh, between like 1500 rupees maximum because it's a 50 ml size so the final verdict is the sunscreen approved by me yes this sunscreen is approved by me approved by me but the only complaint um, about the sunscreen is, is it's a bit expensive for 2050 ml it's a bit expensive and overall mai socha tha ki mai clean beauty jo brand hai iski sare products ke upar mai proper video banao about this brand so let me know if you guys are interested in that ki main ki mujhe clean beauty glass skin moisturizer i have used that i have used their face wash so you know i can do a good review on this brand let me know if you guys are interested so we will definitely do that and let me know if you agar aapko koi bhi confusion hai if you have any question just let me know in the comments down below and if you have not followed in my social media platforms as well so what the hell are you doing just tell me just leave from here and just go follow me on my social media platform you will find so many funny content over there so many skin care content so many self grooming perfume you get a lot of content there and you also get some content by personally me my own lifestyle <laughs> so you have to follow me on my other social media platforms as well especially on my instagram the link here theek hai main niche bhi isko mention kar dunga so go follow me over there as well and thank you so much for watching this video apna bahut zyada dhyan rakhiyega take care everyone allah hafiz bye bye